Hello and welcome. I hope you all have a nice Sunday. I thought for this Sunday, let us have some enjoyment of some nice end behavior. I fed my Campanotus Lichniperda ants a honeybee, a dead honeybee. And look at that ant here in front. They are really unsure where that strange thing came from. See it tap with its ab abdomen on the piece of paper. I think it's some kind of an alarm call. She's really agitated. Honeybees uh, all day long are cleaning out dead bees. But especially in the morning, you can find dead bees on the right in front of the entrance on the flight board. And I picked it up there. It's a dead old bee. I got it in the uh, in its abdomen and in its uh, thorax, so for the ants to to be able to reach it. But they are really unsure where they where it came from. Cleaning up her. Maybe even spraying some formic acid. It's really funny, there's the third worker. Ooh, scary. It suddenly dropped out of the sky. What the beep? They are really anxious about what's happening. It's really funny to see. Cleaning up again. Thumping her abdomen on the paper. Getting agitated by her female sisters. But look at her jump back. It's really funny to see. She's really, really agitated and really doesn't know what to do. There's some spraying of some formic acid, I thought. I think. It's really nice to see. Well, they're a bit in stress and panic now, but because yeah, it suddenly dropped out of the sky. But this is uh, on four times, four times as, f as fast. One worker decides to go for the protein jelly to the right. They're still a bit agitated, but it's getting less every minute. It's been about almost 10 minutes now. One worker is feeding on the jelly. And now let's speed it up some faster. So after 10 minutes, they started to feed on the bee, on the insides of the bee. The exoskeleton they can, can't do anything with. with. That's why I made some cuts in the, in the dead bee. You can, now they are feeding. You can even see, if you watch closely, see their abdomen swell. Very beautiful cleaning up. Going about your business, coming back to the prey, leaving again. So, this way. You can see why it's so fascinating to keep ants as pets. There's really intricate behavior. It's very nice to watch. Feeding on some jelly. You can see from the ant that's feeding on the bee, her abdomen is thicker than the worker to the right. That's because she took up a lot of fluids from the bee and, then, and she will go to feed that on the queen and the queen will lay eggs and so the everything goes round and round. Well thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon. How do